Hi Tony, great to see you this morning at the Wilderness Club. Just want to recap on uh, what we worked on today. So the swing on the left is your one of your first swings of the day. And we can see here as you start to uh, wind up, your arms for me are starting to go a little bit more, a little bit too vertical. It's all a little bit too uh, too upright. So as you start to swing back here, the body's you can see here, the chest isn't really turning and the arms are just going up like a bell ringer in a church. So this position here, for me, your left arm's covering too much of your neck. Okay, uh, left arm, I can see your right shoulder as well. Shouldn't be able to see that. So I'd like to see the left arm a little bit more across the body. And to achieve that, you did that really easily. I just asked you to almost rotate your your chest uh, and then got the arms in a much flatter position. Because the arms are upright there, when you come down, unfortunately, the shaft's going to be a tiny bit upright coming down. And that's why your dispersion was a little bit wild. So you'd hit the odd sort of pull left with a draw, a couple of straight ones, a few blocks to the right, lots of fins. It just wasn't very consistent for you. So getting that left arm behind, sort of deep here uh, and then that elbow down as well would be perfect. And the feeling for you is you've played a lot of tennis in your time. So if I gave you the tennis racket and the ball was bouncing over the net towards you, you're you wouldn't put the racket in this sort of position here because you'd create no power because your body would turn. You would have your left arm sort of across your body here um, with the racket, you know, there ready to sort of swing this way and whack and hit it as hard as possible. So just think of your tennis racket, get the club more around your body. That really help your backswing. Uh, and just front on for me, Tony, just have a look at this. This is you after working on it for me. And this is a practice swing. So we noticed... Um, on the front on before you was tilting a lot more this way so your spine was and now your new backswing that sort of helped that a little bit for you which is good but we was tend to hit the ground quite early in the downswing now as we're coming into impact here this is you do, trying to work on the move we can see here you have quite a lot of lag and I don't know if you remember the picture of Tiger but he was there so that practice swing is good for you trying to hit anywhere in front of the ball for me Tony uh, and you notice it was getting your body forwards, but look at that—you're really strong into impact there. Left hand's definitely ahead of the uh, where the ball is. That's no, really, really good. So that's what you need to work on for me there, and it helps keep your arms a little bit straighter. Be previously, front on your uh, your left arm was quite bent, um, and that's getting your left arm a lot straighter for you. So work on that for me. Back swing, get it around the body. Practice swing in line with the ball and try and hit the ground in front. You can really tell the difference on the grass, but you can see here you're definitely bottomed out in this position here. And once again, the hands are ahead of the ball. So that's the feelings for me to work on. Work on them and I'll see you soon.